Moments ago, a New York jury acquitted Carrie Kennedy, the daughter of the late Senator Robert Kennedy, of driving while impaired. Joining me now, Ashley Banfield, host of uh, CNN's Legal View, along with Jeffrey Tubin and Jean Casares. Good morning to all of you. Good morning. Um, is Jeffrey Tubin on the phone? Okay, he's on the phone. That's why I don't see him. Ashley, let me start with you. Um, you know, run down this verdict for us. So pretty simple. Uh, they just decided that what her lawyers had put in court before them sounded pretty darn plausible. That is that she mixed up medication in the morning. Instead of taking a thyroid pill, she took an Ambien pill and then set out for her day of errands, including going to the gym, Carol, who takes an Ambien with plans to go to the gym. And once on the highway while driving erratically, uh, her experts uh, clearly convinced this jury that she couldn't be responsible for knowing that she was driving um, you know, erratically because of the Zolpidem drug. So they just decided that that sounded plausible enough to them, that there was reasonable doubt that these prosecutors said she's a Kennedy. They even quoted her book as a reason to speak truth to justice in their closings. Uh, they decided that her defense sounded probably something that they could really understand themselves. Okay. And when you say she was driving erratically, she was driving a Lexus SUV, right? And she was swerving down the road and she swerved in front of a tractor trailer, right? And there was a crash, too. No mm -hmm. one was hurt. But, uh, you know, DUIs, driving under the influence and driving uh, while drugged, this is a critical issue. And this is a very interesting defense, too, because this kind of a drug has what you call an amnesia effect. So this jury believed her expert. And by the way, What's even more interesting is they did not believe necessarily what the prosecutor's expert was trying to promulgate. Because under cross-examination, the prosecutor's own expert had to concede she wouldn't have been aware. On this particular drug, she wouldn't have been aware mm -hmm. that she was driving erratically.